We're extra excited today to learn about our new commercial project, The Gourmet City. And uh, we want to thank the H&H &H group for bringing The Gourmet City to us. And I'm going to pass the mic over to Mike, the mic to Mike, and uh, he'll introduce and give you more insight into our beautiful project. Thank you. Good afternoon. On behalf of the H&H &H group, I'd like to welcome every one of you here today. Today we are bringing Gourmet City to you. It's a new project in Toronto. This is Gourmet City. It's located at Kennedy and McNichol, which is actually at 3101 Kennedy Road, and it's on the southeast corner of that junction. It's located in the right area for a residential neighborhood because there are quite a few thousands of residential houses in this place, around this, this area, which makes it heavy traffic area. So having this commercial mall here is the right place at the right time. So what I'd like to tell you about this place also, it's only about five or six minutes drive from every single major highway that we have. The 401, the 404, 407, so there's easy accessibility to this location. Now, I'll tell you about H&H &H Group. H&H &H Group is a, uh, actually, I, I just give me a second. H&H &H Group is actually one of the largest companies in China that does commercial homes, right? It's, uh, it's, an organization that, just give me a second, I'm trying to remember this word. Okay? I, I get lost on it sometimes because we are actually working with builders. And when you're working with builders, you confuse the words sometimes. <laughs> so just bear with me, all right? We are developers. That's the word I was looking for. See, sometimes I get confused with that word, both ends. They're in and our end. So we are developers. We are an international developing corporation. We stretch as far as China. We have large projects in China and Canada. We're actually gonna show you some pictures here of our projects in China. These are million, million square foot on each development here that's been done by the H&H &H group. And in Canada now, we are going to give you Gourmet City, which sits on about 3.4 acres of land. This, this company is actually going to be working, H&H &H Group is going to be working with IBD, develop, IBD Builders. I'm not sure if you guys have heard of IBD before, but it's an Italian building company. They've been around for over 40 years. And the reason we chose them is because Canada was built by Italians. I'm not sure if you know the history of Canada, especially Toronto. But all the big buildings you've seen here, 100 years ago, the Italians came here and they started developing Canada. And then the Portuguese. But the Italians are the main people. IBD Group is actually well established for over 40 years. And they have built many companies, I shouldn't say companies, many buildings for the Ontario government and other organizations. As you can see, this, these are a few of the buildings that they have done, and I'm sure you're all aware of it. This one here on the right is the Markham City Hall. They built that. They've also built the airport. Uh, I'm sure all of you know Pearson International Airport because we are all immigrants. I myself am an immigrant that came from England. So I love that airport. That's why I'm here, because I came to that airport. And they've also worked with many cities like Etobicoke, Toronto, Markham, uh, Unionville. They've put up many town city halls, many other buildings for the government all around. They've also worked on the zoo. They've put up the zoo. So you can tell the integrity of this organization because the government chose them. If the government can choose them, we can choose them. So today we have a very strong relationship with IBD. We have formed a partnership where we will work together on this project from start to finish. When it's completed, it's going to be sitting in an area where the growth, population growth, at this particular time is flourishing. 
immigrant population growth in Scarborough have grown drastically within the last five years. If you guys have seen your neighborhood, I'm sure you've seen lots of new faces, different countries, and you know what? This is a diverse society. I mean, it's a society where we come from all over the world. We love our companies, we love our neighbors, so we will make everything work with us. Now, we sit right in the middle of a highly residential area. It's populated by over 29,000 residences. There are also um, Bow Station, there's Pacific Mall, there's the Longshan Court, which is the senior citizens' home. There's also TNT Supermarket, and it's not far from any, any of these locations. So people traveling back and forth will create high flow of traffic. This is what you're looking for in an environment that can generate good return in your investment. So Gourmet City will actually be one of the best places at this particular time to invest today and reap the futures tomorrow. So taking a chance or taking an opportunity to invest here will give you some good results. At the very end, this is what it's going to look like. From the aerial view of it, it's McNichol Avenue, it's Kennedy Road, it's Millican Boulevard, there's two, two entrances to this plaza. So there's going to be easy access. So that's what people are looking for. Easy accessibility to anything that they're interested in. So what I'd like to do at this particular time actually is to thank Harry, who's from the Harbor Marketing Corporation, and him and his group for all the good work they've done for us. Because of them, we are at this stage right now, and we are creating good partnerships with the Harbor Marketing Group, and also with IBD Development. So I'd like to thank you all for coming here today, and I will now call on Harry to come up and take over from me. <laughs> thank you, Mike.